Good evening, students. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, to Hilda. Okay, in this moment, I'm going to share my screen, okay, for the class today. Okay, student. Well, according to this slide, continue with the next lesson, lesson number three. Fast simple with regular verbs in the affirmative sentence. Okay. According to this topic, it's very important that you understand what type of you are going to use in this topic. For this day, in the first slide, you're going to find the first verb, it is cook. Cook is cocinar. Cook is cocinar. Continue with the next slide. Brush. Brush is cepillar. Brush is cepillar. With the next slide is loud. Loud is rare. Loud is rare. And the next bear is cry. Cry is llorar. Cry is llorar. And the next slide study. Study is estudiar. Study is estudiar. In another verb, snow. Snow is nevar. Snow is nevar. In another slide, verb, jump. Jump is saltar. Jump is saltar. In the next slide, verb, axe. Axe is preguntar. Axe is preguntar. Continue with the next slide. Iron. Iron is planchar. Iron is planchar. And the next bear is play. Play is jugar. Play is jugar. And the next bear, watch. Watch is lavar. Watch is Lavar. The next verb, dance. Dance is bailar. Dance is bailar. Okay. First of all, it's very important to put in practice with the next verb. In this moment, I'm going to choose a student and you say me all verbs. Okay. Participant twenty fourth. Okay. Okay. What is that? Okay. En esta actividad van a participar cada estudiante y van a decirme los verbos antes de ingresar con el tema del día de hoy. Empezamos con Barco Córdoba. Barco Profesor. Okay, good evening. Good evening, Professor. Buenas noches. Okay. How do you say cocinar in English? Cook. Así, Cook. Profesor. Cook. Yeah. Cook. Cook. Cocinar. Okay. Continue with the next bird. Cepillar in English. Brush. Brush. Okay. Brush. Reir in English. 
look loud 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 okay llorar in english cry cry, cry. cry. okay cry estudiar in english um, study study okay study study Nevar in English. It's not. No. Snow. Okay. Snow. Snow. Saltar in English. Jump. Jump. Okay. Jump. Continue. Preguntar in English. Ash. Axe. Okay. Axe. Planchar in English. Iron. 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 Okay. Iron. Jugar in English. Play. Okay. Lavar in English. Wash. 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 Okay. Bailar in English. Dance. 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 Okay. Okay. Thank you. Gracias, profesor. Okay. Continue with the next student. Okay. Here. Alexandra Condori. Good evening, Mr. Good evening. How do you say this bear? Dance. Dance, okay. Continue with the next day. How do you say this bear? Watch. Watch. Okay. How do you say the birds? Play. Play. How do you say these birds? I don't. Okay. How do you say this bird? Ax. Okay. Ax. Ax. Okay. How do you say these birds? Jump. Jump. Okay. How do you say these birds? Snow. Okay. How do you say this bird? A study. Okay. How do you say this bird? Cry. Okay. How do you say this bird? Loud. Loud. Okay. Loud. How do you Lounge. say this bird? Brush. Okay. How do you say this bird? Cook. Okay, very good. Thank you. Continue with the next student. Next student. Blanca Celli. Blanca Celli. Good evening, mister. Good evening. How do you say this bear in English? Cook. Okay, the next bird. Brush. Brush. Okay, the next bird. Louch. Louch. Okay, the next bird. Cry. 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 Okay, cry. 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 Bird. Study. Okay, study. Next bird. Snow. Okay, next bird. Jump. Jump, okay, next bird. Ask. Okay, next bird. I don't. I don't, okay, next bird. Play. Play, okay, next bird. Mm, wish. Watch. 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 Okay, Watch. next bird. Dance. Okay, next. Okay, thank you. Continue. Thank you. Okay. Caroline Lisbeth. Caroline Lisbeth. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How do you say this bird? 
dance. Okay, next verb. Watch. Okay, next verb. Play. Next verb. Play. I groom. Uh-huh, next verb. Axe. Axe, okay, next verb. Jump. Jump, okay, next verb. Snow. Snow, okay, next verb. Study. Okay, next verb. Cry. 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 Okay. Right. Miss Bird. Loads. Okay. Miss Bird. Bird. Miss Bird. Good. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Merlinda. Merlinda. Okay, Merlinda is awesome. Karina. Good evening, Mr. Teacher. Good evening. How do you say this verse? Cock. Next verse. Blocks. Blocks. Brush. 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 Uh-huh. Brush. Okay. Next verse. Blocks. Okay. Blood. Next word. Cry. Cry. Next Cry. word. Study. 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 Next study. Word. Snow. Okay. Next word. Zoom. Next word. Axe. Next word. Iron. 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 Fly. Play, play, okay, play, play. Next bird. Wash. Okay, next bird. Dance. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Miss. Continue with 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 with, with, with Claudia. Oh, good. Good Hi. evening. Good evening, Good evening, Claudia. Okay, how do you say these words? Uh, dance. Okay. Dance. Next verb. Wash. Next verb. Play. Next verb. Idle. Next verb. Ask. Next verb. Jump. Next verb. Snow. Next verb. Study. Next verb. Cry. Next bird. Loud. Next bird. Brush. Next bird. Cook. Okay, very good. Thank you. Yeah. Okay, continue with the next students. Mm. Wendy Catering. Teacher, good evening. Good evening. How do you say this bird? Call. Next. Brood. Brush. 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 La U como si fuera una brush. <coughs> brush. Uh -huh. Brush. Okay. Next. Leu. Loud. 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 Okay, next. Cry. 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 Okay, next. Two days. Study. Study. Okay, next. The snow. Snow, okay, next. Kungs. Jump, okay, jump. jump. Next. Hats. Okay, next. Iron. Okay, next. Play. Okay, next. Wets. Watch. 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 Okay, watch. Next. Dance. Okay, thank you. Continue with another student. Magali Ramirez. 
Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How do you say the birds? Thanks. Next. Watch. Next. Play. Next. Iron. Next. Uh, ash. Next. Jump. 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 Es como la U si fuera la Jump. Ok, next. Snow. Ok, next. Study. And next. Cry. Ok, next. Float. Next. Brush. Next. Cook. Ok, thank you. Thank you, teacher. Ok, continue with the next student. It is trigoso. Iris Trigoso. Good evening. Good evening. Okay, how do you say these verbs? Next. Next. Loud. Okay, next. Try. Try. Okay. Next. Study. Okay, next. Snow. Snow. Ok. Snow. Es como si fuera la O y la W se, se pronuncia como si fuera una U. Snow. Ok. Next. Ok. Next. Ok. Next. Ok. Next. Ok. Next. Ok. Next. Ok, thank you. Continue with another student. Nancy. Nancy Machaca. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How do you say these birds? Dance. This bird. Watch. Next bird. Play. Next bird. Mm. Iron. Iron. Or iron. 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 Okay. Iron. Next bird. Ask. Ask. Okay. Next bird. Whom? Jump. Okay. Jump. Chum. Next bird. It's not. Okay, it's not. Next bird. Study. 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 Okay, next bird. Study. Cry. 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 Okay. Cry. Lords. Okay, next bird. Mm. Brush. 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 Okay. Brush. Next bird. Core. Ah, okay, thank you. Thank you. Okay, we have another student to participate here. Julia Champi. Good evening, Miss uh, Teacher. Okay, good evening. How do you say this bird? Hoof. Okay, next bird. Rush. Next bird. Launch. Next bird. Cry. Next bird. Study. Next bird. Snow. Next bear. Jump. Next bear. Axe. Next bear. Iron. Next bear. Play. Next bear. Wash. Next bear. Dance. Okay, thank you. Thank you, teacher. Okay. 
Continue with, 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 with. Rosa Robles. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How do you say these verbs? Dance. Next verb. Wash. Next verb. Play. Next verb. Iron. Next verb. Hatch. Next verb. Jump. Jump. Okay. Next verb. Snow. 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 No. Okay. Okay. Good. Next verb. To study. Okay. Next verb. Cry. Okay. Next verb. Load. Next verb. Brush. Next verb. Cook. Okay. Thank you. Continue with, 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 Bautista. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How do you say this bird? Cook. Okay. Next bird. Rush. Next bird. Now. Okay. Next bird. Right. Okay. Next bird. Study. Next bird. Snow. Next bird. Jump. Next bird. Pass. Next bird. Iron. Next bird. Play. Next bird. Wash. Next bird. Dance. Okay, thank you, Stuhinda. Thank you. Okay, continue with another student. Karen Tania. Uh, good evening, teacher. Good evening. How do you say this bird? Dance. Next bird. I wash. Watch. Okay. Next bird. <laughs> wash. Okay, that bird. Play. Okay, next verb. Iron. Iron, okay. Iron. Next Iron. Verb. Next verb. As. Okay, next verb. Jump. Okay, jump. Okay, next door. It's no. Okay, next door. Study. Okay, next door. Cry. 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 Okay, next verb. Cry. Louch. Okay, next Louch. verb. Um, brush. Okay, next verb. Cook. Okay, thank you. Thank you, teacher. Okay, continue with Karen Tania. Karen Tania. Eh, me, eh, yo fui lo que dijo profesor. Ah, ah okay, okay, ok, 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 ok. Ah, bueno. Ok. Cintia Heredia. Good evening, mister. Good evening. How do you say this bird? Goof. Next bird. Brush. Next bird. Lows. Okay, next bear. Cry. Next bear. Study. Next bear. Snow. Okay, next bear. Sean. Next bear. Ash. Next bear. Iron. 
Next verb. Play. Next verb. Wash. Next verb. Dance. Okay, very good. Thank you. Same. Okay. Cindy. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How do you say the verbs? Dance. Next verb. Wash. Next verb. Play. Next verb. Iron. Next verb. Ash. Next verb. Next Young. verb. Snow. Next verb. Study. Next verb. Cry. Next verb. Next bear. Brush. Next bear. Cool. Okay, very good. Thank you. Continue with another student. Okay. No. Flor Maria Castañeda. Good evening. Okay, how do you say this bear? Student, how do you say it there? Cook, okay, next bear. Next bear. Okay, okay. Okay, the student got a problem connection. Okay, continue with another student. Elizabeth Quesada. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, okay, continue with you. How do you say this verb? Cook. Next verb. Brush. Next verb. Lights. Louch. Okay. Lights. Louch. Okay. Louch. Next verb. Cry. Cry. Okay. Next verb. Cry. Study. Okay. Next verb. Snog. Okay. Next verb. Jam. Okay, next verb. Axe. Okay, next verb. Idle. Okay, next verb. Play. Okay, next verb. Watch. Okay, next verb. Dance. Very good, thank you. Thank you, teacher. Okay, continue with another student. Mylen. Mylen. Good evening. Good evening. How do you say this verb? Dance. Next verb. What? Next verb. Play. Next verb. I don't. Next verb. Ask. Ask. Next verb. Jump. Jump. Okay. Jump. Jump. Okay, next bear. Snow. Snow. Next bear. Yes, we do. Daddy, next bear. Green. Cry. Cry. Okay. Bear. Loud. Okay, next bear. Brute. Brutch. Next bear. Cool. Okay, very good. Thank you. Continue with another student to participate. Okay. Nalia. Teacher. Hello. How do you say this verb? Cook. Next verb. Brush. 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 Yeah. Next verb. Le, le, le. Louch. Louch. Yeah. Okay. Next verb. Cry. Cry. Okay. Yeah. Next verb. Studying. Study. Study. Next verb. 
Olha que minha peça tá aí. Esse não? Não, ok. Next bell. Who? Ok, next bell. Ash. Next bell. Hayron. Lei. Next bell. Wash. Ok, next bell. Dance. Ok, thank you so much. Ok, see you then. Well. Oh, okay. Continue about this verse. Okay. According to this verse, we are going to choose past simple and regular verb. You are going to choose past simple regular verb when the action is in the past. Okay. And now it's very important to recognize the following verb in the infinite form or base form. This verb you're going to change it into the past according to the following rulers. Spelling rulers for regular verbs. Base form, past, and root. The first verb, watch. According to watch, in past, watch. You're going to add indeed according to this verb. Another verb, like or leaf. Leave it. According to this bell, when the bell ends in vowel E, you are going at letter D in the past. Another verb is form. Stop. Stop. According to the bell, consonant, vowel, and consonant, double the last consonant and adds ED. Another base for study. Studied. Consonant plus Y, change Y to I at ED. Okay, student. In the past simple, regular verb, only you are going to add. ED, but according to this base form and change it into the path, you are going to find some rulers. According to these examples, in this slide, it's very important that you understand according to this ruler. Okay? According to the base form, watch. According to the base form, lives. According to the base form, stop. According to the base form, study. First thing, you are going to make the past simple form. Watch, watch, cry, cry, shot, shot, love, love, child, child, talk, talk. Arrive, arrive, plan, plan, listen, listen, pray, pray it. Okay, only you are going to add ed and change base form into past simple. Okay, students, don't forget following these rulers. Okay, according to this past simple in regular pair, it's very important to you understand what is the pronunciation in each pair in past simple. For instance, ed bears that are pronounced d or d. In this case, is we choose our voice to pronounce the last sounds of the verb. That is, our vowel scores the verge. The ending ed will sound like a d. After sounds such as the vowels, letter B, letter G, letter C or set, letter V, 
letter M, letter N, letter L, letter R, letter W, letter J. Okay. According to these consonants and vowels and symbols, it's very important the correct pronunciation the words in the past simple. ¿Qué nos quiere decir aquí? De hecho, que en el pasado simple es muy sencillo porque vamos a agregar la terminación ED siguiendo las reglas que hemos mencionado anteriormente. Ahora, en lo que respecta a la pronunciación, hay que tener mucho cuidado cómo vamos a pronunciar el pasado. ¿Por qué? Aquí el pasado es muy diferente a lo que es el base form, la forma base, o infinity form, la forma infinitiva. Entonces, Aquí nos dice bien claro que cuando termina la terminación ED, va a sonar como una D. Tenemos que dibujar esa D. Simuladamente dibujamos la D. ¿Ok? ¿En cuándo vamos a dibujar esa D? Cuando vemos que encontramos una consonante como la letra B, como la letra G, como la letra Z, la U, la V, la M, la N, la L... R, la W, la J, y este símbolo, y también en las vocales. Ahora, por ejemplo, acá tenemos una palabra que dice batch. Ahora, ¿cómo lo voy a pronunciar el pasado? Batch. Call. Call. La E va a sonar un poquito más baja y la D se dibuja más. Listen. Listen. Grab. Grab. Ahora, hay otro caso también que dice I did birds that are pronounced T. Se pronuncia como una T. Y we do not use our voice to pronounce the last sound of the birds. That is, our vowels cords do not vibrate. The in the ED we sound like a T. Okay. And now, after and voice sounds, with P, with K, with CH, with SH, with S, with F, with H, and now the symbol, Chisa, okay. And for examples, hair, health, look, loot, snitch. Snitch, watch, watch. Ahí vemos ahí la, que tenemos aquí la imagen como la pronunciación de la palabra en pasado. Held, looked, snitched, watch. Ahora, hay otro caso también de otro tipo de pronunciación, pero en este segundo caso hay que tener cuidado, pero ¿cómo voy a pronunciar como si fuera una T? Cuando encontramos la consonante P, como en el caso de Hell, la consonante K, como en el caso de Look, la consonante CH, también tenemos SH, como en el caso de Watch, la letra S, con la letra F, en el caso de Sniffs, y la letra H, o también con el sonido de la pronunciación como si fuera un chita, como un sonido. Ahora, hay un tercer caso de pronunciación. Y de birds that are pronounced e d ok, I did. Y la pronunciación o regular peor ends with did or did. The end e did will be pronounced as e d. Remember, your vocal cords should produce a vibration or hum in your throat. Ahora, cuando yo lo voy a pronunciar como si fuera un y D, cuando encontramos este caso de ejemplos. Cuando termina en lo que es en la letra T como want, o cuando termina en la letra D como decide. Decide. Ahora, en esos casos, ¿cómo sería la pronunciación de want en pasado? Wanted. Decide. Decide. 
Muy bien, ahí tenemos lo que es la pronunciación, algunos ejemplos, y en esos casos, cuando yo lo voy a pronunciar de esa manera? Cuando tenemos aquí el sonido de la T y el sonido de la D, se pronuncia como si fuera ID en el pasado. Muy bien, hay que tener mucho cuidado con esos tres casos de pronunciación. Cuando tengo que dibujar la D, como en caso de Betch, en caso de Call, en el caso de Listen, en el caso de Grab. Y también cuando encontremos vocales o también estas consonantes que están mencionando la regla. Otros casos que le mencioné, que le voy a pronunciar como si fuera una T. ¿En qué casos? En el caso de Help, porque termina en la P. En el caso de Look, porque termina en la K. En el caso de CH, es CH, como en el caso de Watch. La letra S, la letra F, como en el caso de Sniff. La letra H o el símbolo de Tita en la pronunciación. Y el último caso que tenemos aquí, que voy a pronunciarlo como si fuera ID, cuando suena la pronunciación como una T o como una D, como en el caso de Wanted y como en el caso de Desired. Ok. In this slide, you got these examples about these verbs in base form, and you're going to change it into past simple. O está ahí. Visit. You are going to add it did, and now in the past simple, be seated. Another, play. You're going to add it did, and now the new pronunciation, played. Continue with the next, dance. Como termina en E, ¿qué voy a hacer? Solamente agrego la D, y sería la palabra en pasado, dance. Tenemos la siguiente, skip, y tenemos una nueva palabra en pasado, skip. La siguiente, try, según la regla cambiamos la Y por la I, agregamos ED y sería try it. Muy bien, ahora sí, vamos a participar con estas palabras. Tenemos aquí la oración que dice The girls with their toys yesterday. Las niñas con sus juguetes ayer. Otra cosa también muy importante. En el past simple, in the past simple, you are going to fight with the expression. Why the expression? Yesterday, last month, last year, and another day, or age. Si encontramos esas expresiones, nos vamos a dar cuenta que vamos a hacer el past simple. Ahora, tenemos la oración que dice The girl with their toy yesterday. Y tenemos ahí el verbo play. La estudiante que levante la mano, la primera estudiante que levante la mano va a leer esta oración. A ver. Ok, Rosa Robles. Rosa Robles. Teacher, buenas noches. Good evening. A ver, Rosa Robles. Tenemos... Ok, tenemos esta oración que dice The girl with their toy yesterday. Y tenemos el verbo play. ¿Cómo me leerías toda la oración en pasado? Gr the girls. A ver, the, the, girl, the girls. Played. Played. En pasado. Played. 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 Ahí está, mira. Played. Played. With. With. Air. Their. Toys. Yesterday. Toys. Toys. Yesterday. Ajá. Uh -huh. oh, ok. Entonces la oración sería The girls played with their toy yesterday. Entonces vemos aquí cómo sufrió el cambio del verbo play en el pasado. Sería played. Vamos a ver la siguiente. Tenemos ahí el snow. Ya le hemos visto el snow. Dice it last Christmas. It last Christmas. La Navidad pasada. ¿Qué sucedió la Navidad pasada? A ver, ¿quién levanta la primera manito? Nancy Mechan Torres. Good evening, mister. 
Good evening. It's, it's okay. snow last Christmas. Okay, it snowed, snowed last Christmas. It snowed last Christmas. Okay. Thank you. Continue with another. Loud. Ya sabemos lo que significa loud. Ahora, the students at the funny shop. The students at the funny shop. Los estudiantes de una broma graciosa. Vamos a, ver. a ver, ¿quién levantó primerito la mano? Vamos a ver. Nirvana Gutiérrez. Nirvana. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How do you read the sentence in the past simple? And the students launched at the funny hook. Ok, very good. Ahí vemos que el launch se transformó en pasado. Launch. Ok, the student launched at the funny shop. Ok, continue with the next slide. Cry. Ahora, el verbo cry. The baby all day yesterday. The baby all day yesterday. El bebé todo el día de ayer. Vamos a ver. A ver vamos a ver. Karina. Teacher. Hello. Hello. Read a sentence, please, in the past simple. Okay, the baby cried all day yesterday. Okay, cry, baseball, and the past simple, cried. Okay, continue with the next slide. Brush, brush. Bobby, his this this morning. Bobby, his this this morning. Bobby, su sientes. Esta mañana. Vamos a ver. ¿Quién levanta la manito? Elizabeth Quesada. Teacher. Ok, read the sentence. Bobby Ruiz Day. Ruiz Day. Is the morning. Bobby Brushet. Ok. Brush. Bobby Brushet. His this this morning. Bobby his brushed this. his this this morning. Morning. Okay, thank you. Continue with the next. Cook. The chef our dinner last night. The chef our dinner last night. El cocinero nuestra cena anoche. Vamos a ver. Magali Ramírez. The, the chef cooked okay. or dinner last night. Okay. The chef cooked our dinner last night. El verbo cook, en pasado, cook it. Okay. Study. I all weekend for the sun. I all weekend for the sun. Yo, todo el fin de semana para el examen. Vamos a ver. Siguiente. Julia Champi. Julia Champi. Así. Ok. Continue with another student. Karen Garlarza. Karen Galarza. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Yes. Okay. Complete a sentence using the past simple. I, uh, am, I am. I am. No. I am is that exam. A ver. Estamos viendo lo que es el past simple regular verbs, no el verb to be. Okay. Entonces la oración sería, I started all weekend for the sun. I started all weekend for the sun. El artículo, ok, the article, este artículo tiene dos pronunciaciones. 
Una de ellas es cuando hay una consonante, se pronuncia como that. that. Y la otra es, se pronuncia como di. di. Esta pronunciación de di es cuando encontramos que hay una vocal que le acompaña. En el caso de san, comienza con una vocal. Entonces la pronunciación sería di san. I started all weekend for this song. ¿Ok? Ok, profesor. Ok, teacher. Okay. ok, ok, don't worry. Continue the next slide. Ask. Sang a lot of questions during math class. Sang a lot of questions during math class. Sang muchas preguntas durante la clase de matemática. Ahora vamos a utilizar el ax en el pasado. Vamos a ver. Voluntario, voluntaria, que pueda completar yeah, la oración. Yeah, teacher, yo... Teacher, a ver quién habló. Julia Champi. Ok, Julia Champi. Ok, Julia uh, Champi, complete the uh, using the past simple. Sam asked a lot of questions. Ask a lot okay. of questions during much clutch. Sam asks a lot of questions during Max class. Ok. Sam asks a lot of questions during match class. Ok, student, thank you. Entonces vemos que la palabra acts en pasado sería act. Act. Continuamos. Dance. Dance. Everybody at the wedding last Saturday. Everybody at the wedding last Saturday. Todos en la boda del sábado pasado. Y utilizamos lo que es el verbo dance. ¿Cómo lo van a cambiar dance al pasado? A ver. Voluntario, voluntaria, que levanten la manito. Dice Nirvana. Nirvana que participar. Vamos a ver Nirvana. Everybody dance at the wedding last Saturday. Ok, very good. Then dance it. Ok, very good. Ok, verify. Ok. Continue with the next. Chang. The boy on the trampoline an hour out. The boy on the trampoline an hour out. Ahora vamos a utilizar lo que es el verbo chang. Cambiarlo al pasado. Voluntarios, a ver. ¿Quién desea leer la oración? A ver, ¿quién lo completa? Oh. Mm, Definitely, teacher, vite. Ok, Caroline. Yes. Ok, complete a sentence using the version in the past simple. Mm, the boy jumped on the tripoline and her ego. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Okay, very good. Continue with the next. Watch. Hear the dishes after breakfast. Hear the dishes after breakfast. Okay, another volunteer to participate in completing this sentence. Claudia Chávez Ríos. Yes. Claudia. She was her that is. Okay. okay. She was saying that is just after very fast. Okay, according to the watch, changing uh -huh. into the past simple. ¿Me escuchó? Sí, se escuchó. Aunque recordaba, pues se logró escuchar una parte. Okay, thank you. Continue with the next slide. Iron. Mom, her children's clothes on Sunday. Mom, her children's clothes on Sunday. I need a volunteer to complete this bell iron in the past simple and week all sentence in the past simple. I need a volunteer to participate here. 
now volunteer to participate in completing this sentence using the verb iron. Teacher, is mom, teacher, okay. is mom ironed her children's clothes on the Sunday? Okay, very good. Okay, iron, iron it. Okay, very good. Continue with the next. Yes. Okay, thank you. Okay, look at the picture and choose the best balloon. Okay. Well. Okay, according to this back. Okay, according to this activity, you get this sentence I, my mom, yesterday. And now, in the cycle with a different color, you're going to find the verbs in the past simple. But one verb in the past simple is right. Okay. With a color yellow helped, color sky blue helped, and color orange helped. Okay. What is the correct in this sentence? Color yellow, color sky blue, or color orange to complete the sentence. I help it. Light, light blue. Color sky blue. Circle. Okay, okay. Uh -huh. Color sky blue. Okay. I helped my mom yesterday. Okay. Color sky blue is right. Okay. Thank you. Continue with the next. Liz sang delicious soup last week. Liz sang delicious soup last week. Alternatives. Color yellow, cat, cookie, and cookie. Yellow. 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 Color, yellow. Color yellow. yellow. Color yellow is correct. Okay. This cookie sound delicious suit last week. Okay. Very good. Continue with the next. Okay. The boys football yesterday. The boys football yesterday. And now you got some alternatives. Color yellow. 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 Color yellow. Okay. Color yellow is the right. Okay. Color yellow is the right. Okay. Very good. Continue with the next. The baby all night. The baby all night. Okay, alternatives. Color red. Purple. 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 Okay, color purple. Okay, color purple is white. Okay, very good. Continue with the next slide. We TV in the evening. We TV in the evening. Alternatives. Okay. What did the correct? Yellow. Yellow. Color? Yellow. Yellow. Color yellow. Yellow. Okay. Color yellow is right. Watch it. Okay. Very good. Continue with an slide. Lucy at me after school. Alternative. Green, sky blue, and orange or yellow. Okay. Why the correct option? What it? Orange. 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 Uh -huh. Color orange is white. Lucy smiled and make after school. Okay, very good. Continue with the next slide. Day to school yesterday. Color green, color pink, and color yellow. Why the color? Yellow. Yellow. Or yellow. Yellow. Work it. Okay. yellow. Yellow. Walk it. Okay. Yellow. Yellow. Walk it. Okay. Continue. I out all the windows in the morning. Alternative. What is correct? What color is sky correct? Sky blue. Color is sky blue. Sky blue. Okay. Color is sky blue. Look at. Okay. 
My dad, my car on Saturday. My dad, my car on Saturday. What color is white? What color is white? What color is white? Yellow. Color yellow. yellow. Color yellow. Okay. Okay. Color yellow. Okay. Thank you. Continue with the next. My friend me last weekend. My friend me last weekend. What color is white? Purple. Purple. Color purple. purple. Color purple. Color purple. No, color purple. No. What is yellow? Color yellow. Yellow. Okay. Yellow. yellow. Not purple. Okay. Continue with the next. The frog into the water. The frog into the water. Alternative. What is white? Yeah. Yellow. 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 yellow, yellow, okay, chocolates, okay, color yellow, okay, okay, student, you're going to find this chart, okay, and according to the chart, it's very important to recognize what is the right and and it, it did, okay, in the past simple, the base form, okay, try to play the bell into the right column, okay? What is the bird in base form? Cook, say, say, need, listen, watch, spy, okay? Another, see? No, okay, wait, 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 okay. Okay, employ, drop, right, hot, worry, talk, Open, annoy, move, study, enjoy, bake, cry, and stop. Okay. Well, this base form, you are going to complete it in the correct place in this chart with edit. Okay. With I did, with D, or with double consonant and adds ed. Okay, it's very important to practice this activity and complete the base for and write this chart in the correct place using the past simple. Okay, and now all I want to Christmas is a monster. According to the past simple, you are going to find in this story. Okay, I need a volunteer to read English slide. Okay, George. And now. Okay, here, 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 here. Okay, I need a volunteer to read this part of slide to participate. I need a volunteer to participate in this slide and this activity. Marta Castillo. Marta Castillo. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Do you want to participate in this activity? Um, I'll read it. And read. Okay, read. Okay, read this part. Um, this story. Uh, it, it all happening last Christmas. Okay. I looked out of the window. It snowed a lot that night. There was a lot of snow on the tree and on the ground too. Okay. okay. Thank you. And now, Thank according you. according this part, according this part, the story, it's very important to identify what is the bird in the past simple regular bird. Why the bird? I need a volunteer. 
According to this story, this part of story, what is the bird? In past simple. Claudia Chavez. Claudia Chavez is silence, okay. Necesito aquí una voluntaria, voluntario que me pueda identificar cuáles son los verbos en pasado que puedan encontrar en este escucha? Ah, no. no le escucho bien, no hay, no hay. Claudia, ok, Claudia, ok. Ok, Claudia. What is yeah. the word in past simple? Ok. Look at. Ok. Snow wet. Snow wet, ok. Okay. Okay, thank you. Okay. Well. Era algo sencillo. Primero se tenía que leer parte de la historia y luego identificamos cuáles son los verbos en pasado, los verbos regulares que nosotros encontramos. Okay. Okay, is now is now it? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Ya, yeah. vamos a la siguiente parte. A ver. Okay. And now this part. Nirvana, okay. Do you want to participate and read this part, the story? Uh, there was one thing I really wanted for Christmas, a real monster. And so I decided to help my parents. Okay, Nirvana. Nirvana, and say me, what is that better in past simple do you find this part of the story? I wanted and decided. Okay, very good. Thank you. Okay. Another volunteer to participate and read this small story. Okay, another volunteer to participate in this small story. Okay, I'm going to call. Elizabeth Quesada. Uh, moon, moon what? In day. Uh, Kitchen, <laughs> she cook my son guess for for very mm, facts. She holds cooks me some there. Uh, my I uh, I am sites her. All I am wants for Christmas is a real monster. Okay. okay, thank you, Elizabeth. Once once in the kitchen, she cooked me some eggs for breakfast. She also cooked me some teeth. I said her all I want for Christmas. Continue with the next slide. Okay. After Bray Fox, I heard that we decorate the house. I say him. Or I want for Christmas is a real monster. And next, I heard my mom. In the kitchen, we bake a delicious chocolate cake and cook the dinner. We smile a lot. 
In the afternoon, I play with my little sisters. I said then, all I want for Christmas is a real monster. Then I was in my room, I worked out the present for my family, and I waited for the evening. Everyone was in the living room on Christmas evening. The dinner was delicious. That played a sound card on the piano. We have for Christmas is a real monster. But there weren't any monster in the boxes. Suddenly, someone knocked at the door. When I opened it, I cried out. It was a real monster. Everyone laughed at me and I said, I never want a monster again. Okay? And now, according to this topic, it's very important that you understand when you're going to choose about the, the past simple in regular pair and the society and change some rulers, okay, into regular pair in the past simple. And according to this story, you're going to find the difference pairs in past simple regular pairs. Okay, student. And well, according to activity for the next, uh, next week, Okay, wait a moment. Okay. According to this activity for the next week, a simple regular birds and letter A, according to this bird in the base forge, you are going to write in the blank space into past simples, regular birds. And according with the next activity, letter B, choose the best of one. In each sentence, okay, you're going to find in the color black, okay, two alternatives of the birds, the past simple regular birds, okay, and you're going to cycle, okay, cycle the color, letter C, home and doubt, okay. In each line, okay, in different, According to this topic, okay, past simple regular birds. And now, you are going to fight with birds in past simple, no regular bird. Okay, no regular bird. Okay, and according, you are going to cycle in according to this number. For us say, number one, listen it, order it, and did. What is the word? in this line. According to this line, listen it, past simple regular bear. Order it, past simple regular bear. But this is not past simple, is not past simple regular bear. It's past simple irregular bear. Okay, according to this, you're going to cycle this word. Okay, and now in each numbers, you are going to find one word. Okay, and continue with letter D, you are going to find the different centers, okay? And you're going to check true or false. Or stay. Number one, I called my friend yesterday. True or false? False, teacher. False, okay. I called oh. my friend yesterday. Okay, uh -huh. very good. Okay, because that bear is not a simple regular bird. Okay, it is in the infinity of phase four. Okay, and now in each sentence, you're going to identify it and you're going to check true or false. Continues. Letter if. Fill in the blanks. Okay. In each sentence, in parentheses, you're going to find that word in the base form, and you're going to write in the past simple regular words. Okay, student. And now, according to your teacher, it's very important to take a photo, okay, when you finish 
about this activity and send it into my WhatsApp. But it's very important to take a photo, okay, when you are going to do this activity. ¿Qué quiero decir con esto? Que ustedes cuando ya tengan la actividad realizada o hecha, van a tomar la hojita y se van a tomar la foto respectivamente y van a tener que enviarme para poder enviarle a su profesora que en realidad están realizando la actividad correspondiente. No es como un requisito que me acaba de decir la profesora, y bueno, tenemos que cumplir todo. Aparte de eso, eh, justamente estaba pensando que cada uno de ustedes, cada uno de ustedes, si hay un varón por ahí, entonces van a hacer una diapositiva. ¿En qué consiste la diapositiva? Como hemos visto la historia, cuando estaban haciendo uso de los verbos en pasado. Ahora, ustedes tienen opción de hacer la historia acerca de una actividad que ustedes han realizado o algún evento que ustedes han vivido o acerca de una actividad que ustedes han realizado o vacaciones que ustedes han tenido, pero el texto tiene que estar en inglés y hacer uso de los verbos en pasado de los verbos regulares en pasado. Con, se puede, pueden poner las imágenes correspondientes, las diapositivas, y entonces cada una de ustedes van a exponerlo aquí en clase. Profesor en inglés. Exactamente. Editor. Ajá, exactamente. Sí. Puedo, puedo tener una semana para que puedan practicarlo, y entonces la diapositiva se comparte aquí en pantalla, como estoy haciendo yo, y justamente cada uno de ustedes va a leer lo que ustedes han redactado usando uso del pasado simple de los verbos regulares. ¿Me dejo entender? Sí. Okay, yes. perfecto. Okay. Entonces tenemos tres puntos elementales principales aquí. Uno, esta tareita que tenemos aquí, esta tareita la van a realizar y se van a tomar la foto junto con la tarea que ustedes han realizado y también lo van a enviar. Yo le tengo que enviar a la en toda arriba redactando un texto en inglés haciendo uso del pasado simple de los verbos regulares. Perfecto, está todo claro. Lo que van a realizar. Sí. Está todo claro. Pero... Oh, ok. Les, pregu les pregunto porque después van a estar acá en el WhatsApp preguntándome ahí justamente cuando yo estoy trabajando en la mañana y me es difícil responder la, los mensajes por eso, por eso que demoro en responder. Ya sabrán entender porque tengo que trabajar en la mañana y en la tarde y justamente un poquito que me dificulta en responder. Y por eso que les dejo bien claro explicándoles, si tienen alguna duda, me lo mencionan y lo vuelvo a explicar nuevamente para dejar todo claro lo que van a realizar para la próxima clase. Eh, profesor, la foto... La foto que está pidiendo con la tarea realizada con nosotros, ¿no? O sea, que nos vea nosotros solo el trabajo. Ya, a ver. Como le hemos... el, trabajo, el trabajo tú lo vas a imprimir, Ajá. perfecto. Ya, lo vas a escribir, lo vas a realizar. Muy bien. Entonces, cuando tú ya terminas de realizar la actividad, ¿qué es lo que vas a hacer? A ver, voy a tomar una fotito, a ver, por aquí. Vamos a ver, no, aquí está. Pues el ejemplo. Ya. Supongamos que esta sea mi actividad. Muy bien, pongamos que esta sea mi actividad. Perfecto. Entonces, yo lo realicé la actividad y entonces yo me voy a tomar la foto. Ahí que ahí me pueda tomar la foto donde yo estoy, ya realicé la actividad correspondientemente que se ha encomendado. ¿Me dejo entender? Sí, profesor, ahora claro? sí. Ah, 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 sí, es que yo pensé que lo íbamos a seguir mandando como hasta la clase pasada que nomás hemos mandado. No sé. La imagen de la hoja. Y se va a enviar la imagen justamente y también se va a enviar la foto respectiva que han realizado la actividad. Perfecto. Ok. Oh, ok. No se olviden también, por favor, de la diapositiva que se lo van a exponer cada uno de ustedes, que es también parte de su evaluación de lo que es expresión oral. Haciendo uso del pasado simple de los verbos regulares, así como hemos visto, hemos visto en la diapositiva de ese modelo de ejemplo. Puede ser de una historia puede ser de un evento que ustedes han realizado, puede ser de algunas vacaciones que ustedes han tenido, pero haciendo uso del pasado simple de los verbos regulares, donde ustedes lo van a exponer. Si, si le pueden agregar fotos, respectivamente, mucho mejor, todavía mejor. ¿Perfecto? 
¿Alguna pregunta, alguna duda antes de culminar? Nos quedan dos minutos todavía. Ya, profesor. Ok. Ok. Ok, ciudad. Dígame, Magali. Vamos a este, hacer individual, ¿no? ¿Trabajo individual o, o, o de grupo? No, individual. Ya, profesor. Individual. Para que no tengan problemas, porque justamente surge el problema de que a veces no se reúnen, eh, la que más trabajó lo hizo, la que no hizo nada y se gana la nota fácilmente. No, cada uno se defiende por sí misma. Ya, yeah. ok, profesor. Ok, ok, student, for a moment, the class is over. Ok, I hope you got a nice weekend. Ok, and see you for the next week on Ivana. ¿Dice decir algo? Maestro, tengo una consulta. Ya son dos actividades que lo hemos mandado. No sé si el mío lo habrá recepcionado porque no figura como si lo hubiera visto. No, sí, justamente le estaba mencionando a las alumnas que como son cantidad de trabajos que tengo que revisar y los No se preocupen porque este fin de semana ya todos los trabajos van a estar encarpetados. ¿Qué quiere decir? Cada uno va a estar en su carpeta correspondiente de la luna que envió la actividad. Y aparte de eso, yo lo voy a subir en un drive, ¿ok? Donde tengo que compartirlo con las profesoras respectivamente para que puedan compartir con sus estudiantes. Donde se ve el trabajo que ustedes han enviado. Y aparte, lo que yo he revisado el trabajo está está bien o en qué parte han fallado. ¿Perfecto? Karina. Bueno, maestro, gracias. Profesor, ¿cuántas actividades está dejando? Porque la verdad, profesor, yo estoy en, en, en este momentos muy difíciles y no pude concentrarme bien en la clase, profesor. Bueno, ¿Cuántas actividades? ya la actividad número uno es hacer haciendo uso de lo que es el pasado simple de los verbos regulares que hemos visto en clase. La, el punto número dos es que justamente cuando ya terminas de hacer la actividad, ¿ok? Tomamos una fotito de que hemos realizado la actividad y me lo envían también. Y el tercer punto es que van a hacer una diapositiva, una diapositiva, muy bien, una diapositiva acerca de una historia, un evento, o acerca de sus vacaciones que ustedes han tenido, si pueden agregar fotos, pero haciendo uso de los verbos regulares en pasado en inglés. en una diapositiva, y ustedes van a exponerlo, cada uno de ustedes van a exponerlo. Ya, yeah, profesor. Ok, ok, student, la clase es over, and goodbye, ok, see you, bye bye. Chao, profesor, gracias. Bye Bye. bye. Ok, Bye, thank teacher. you, Bye, teacher. goodbye, Bye, teacher. goodbye.